Welcome back to the Ichi Mahjong Guide. When you play Mahjong, you don't just play one game. You play a full round of games. The most common is a Hanchan, otherwise called an East-South match. In an East-South match, uh, the winds rotate around the table uh, twice. Let's say you're the first one to be East, so you get this East counter here. It's on your corner of the table, indicating that you were first East. You roll the dice, you play a game. Uh, once that game's over, the next player gets to be east and it goes around and around like that so once every player is east and east has rotated back to you it's now the south round so you flip the indicator over there's usually a south on the other side and then you play another set of uh, wins so that everyone gets to be east one more time and so then once those eight uh, total games are over with everyone having been east twice then the match is over, and that's when the winners decided. Uh, again, we're going to talk about scoring quite a bit later, but for now I just want to explain what a uh, usual match of Mahjong is like. You might not play uh, East-South, you might just play East, which is called a Tonpusen, where everyone's only East once. But the most common is a Hanchan where, or an East-South match where everyone is East twice. And the first round is East, and the second round is South. The wins where you're sitting matter, um, regardless of which one it is. And the, the round wind, which is usually either east or south, that also matters for scoring purposes, but we uh, aren't gonna go into most of that right now. What I am gonna talk about in this video is the importance of being east. So regardless of if it's east or south round, the player who is east gets some special bonuses for being east. Not only are they the first one to draw, which logically you would think would give them an advantage in making their hand first, they also gain more points for winning a hand. The amount of points is one and a half times the usual amount of points, but they also carry a penalty if they lose. If someone else wins by Tsumo or drawing their winning tile themselves, East loses twice as much as the other two players. So again, we're gonna talk about scoring later. One thing I wanted to talk about in this video is that if you are east and you win the hand while you're east, you get to play an extra round as east. So the wins don't rotate, you're east again, you basically got a bonus game, or in Japanese, a then-chan. So that means you can't even be sure if you're just playing eight games in a Hanchan or an east-south match. There might be many, many more if the player who is east keeps uh, winning hands. Uh, and this is the main bonus. Of course you get more points, but then you have more chances to get more points if you win while you're east. This is one of the uh, asymmetrical aspects of Mahjong. So it, it does sound kind of broken since, oh, the players who east gets all these benefits and they only get this small um, disadvantage if someone else wins. But then that, that opportunity to be east is shared equally amongst all the players. So the strategy for uh, when you're playing as East versus when you're playing as South, West, or North is usually different. And you have to take that into account when you're determining what kind of hand to make or what kind of hand to win. All right, I know this was a short video, but uh, it's important to make sure that you know how full matches of Mahjong work and the benefits of being East. As usual, if you have any questions, feel free to comment and thank you for watching.